Welcome to our first set of pharmacy practice questions. This pharmacy quiz covers different pharmacy topics, including introduction, scope, and history of pharmacy. These are multiple choice questions, consisting of question stems, correct answer, and distractors. Read the questions carefully. Try to answer the questions without looking at the options and compare your answer with the options. The correct answer and its explanation will be displayed at the end of each question. You can also refer to the video that we have already uploaded on this topic. We wish you good luck. Let's begin. Question 1. From which language the word pharmacon is taken? Option A, German. Option B, Greek. Option C, Latin. Option D, French. The correct answer is option B. The term of pharmacy comes from word pharmacon in Greek. Question 2. The term of pharmacy comes from word, the pharmacon in Greek. What is the meaning of this word? Option A, poison. Option B, medicine. Option C, both options A and B. Option D, none of the above. The correct answer is, option C. The term of pharmacy comes from the word pharmacon in Greek, that means poison or medicine. Question 3. Pharmacy is one of the health professions divisions that Option A includes health science, Option B includes chemical science, Option C is a combination of health science and chemical science, Option D includes none of the above. The correct answer is Option C. Pharmacy is one of the health professions divisions that is combination of health science and chemical science which is responsible to ensure the effective and safe use of pharmaceutical drugs. Question 4. The scope of pharmaceutical practice includes Option A. Traditional pharmaceutical practice Option B. Modern pharmaceutical practices Option C. Both options A and B Option D, none of the above. The correct answer is, option C. The scope of pharmaceutical practice includes, traditional pharmaceutical practice, such as compounding, and dispensing of drug forms. Also, modern pharmaceutical practices, that are related to, patient care and healthcare, efficacy, and safety evaluation of drug usage, and the provision of drug information. Question 5. Traditional pharmaceutical practice includes which of the following? Option A. Compounding of drug forms. Option B. Dispensing of drug forms. Option C. Both options A and B. Option D. None of the above. The correct answer is, option C. Traditional pharmaceutical practice includes compounding and dispensing of drug forms. Question 6. Modern pharmaceutical practices are related to which of the following? Option A. Patient care and health care. Option B. Efficacy and safety evaluation of drug usage. Option C. The provision of drug information. Option D. All of the above. The correct answer is, option D. Modern pharmaceutical practices are related to patient care and healthcare, efficacy and safety evaluation of drug usage and the provision of drug information. Question 7. Who is called the father of medical science? Option A, Hippocrates. Option B, King Frederick. Option C, Paracelsus. Option D, Abu Ali Sina. The correct answer is, option A. Hippocrates is called, the father of medical science. Question 8. In the era of, which of the following, 
only doctors had the obligation to diagnose the illness suffered by the patient as well as to prepare the herb or the medicine for the patient. Option A, Johann Jacob Wepfer. Option B, Hippocrates. Option C, King Frederick. Option D, Claudius Galen. The correct answer is, Option B. In the era of Hippocrates, only doctors had the obligation to diagnose the illness suffered by the patient as well as to prepare the herb or the medicine for the patient. Question 9. In his medical practice, which of the following had used more than 200 species of plants? Option A, Abu Ali Sina. Option B, King Frederick. Option C, Hippocrates. Option D, Johann Jacob Wepfer. The correct option is, option C. In his medical practice, Hippocrates had used more than 200 species of plants. Question 10. In 1240 BC, which of the following took the initiative to distinguish medicine with the science of pharmacy? Option A, Hippocrates. Option B, Paracelsus. Option C, Abu Ali Sina. Option D, King Frederick. The correct option is, Option D. In 1240 BC, the Germany king, named King Frederick, took the initiative to distinguish medicine with the science of pharmacy. Question 11. Since when, the word pharma began to be widely used? Option A, 1200 to 1400s. Option B, 1,400 to 1,600s. Option C, 1,600 to 1,800s. Option D, 1,800 to 2,000s. The correct answer is, Option B. Since 1,400 to 1,600s, the word pharma began to be widely used. Question 12. Which of the following argued that to make a medicinal preparation, it is necessary to know the content of the active ingredient. Option A, Abu Ali Sina. Option B, King Frederick. Option C, Paracelsus. Option D, Johann Jacob Wepfer. The correct answer is, Option C. Paracelsus argued that to make a medicinal preparation, it is necessary to know the content of the active ingredient. Question 13. Which of the following made a drug from a substance that had been known already? Option A, Paracelsus, Option B, Abu Ali Sina, Option C, Hippocrates, Option D, Claudius Galen. The correct answer is, Option A. Paracelsus made a drug from a substance that had been known already. Question 14. Which of the following connected the healing of the disease with the working theory of medicine? Option A, Hippocrates, Option B, Paracelsus, Option C, Abu Ali Sina, Option D, Claudius Galen. The correct answer is, Option D. Claudius Galen, connected the healing of the disease, with the working theory of medicine, which is the field of pharmacology. Question 15. Which of the following, are contributions of Abu Ali Sina, towards pharmacy? Option A, he wrote several books, on methods of collecting, and storing medicinal plants, and medicine making process, Option B, he combined medical knowledge, from several countries, to produce better treatment, Option C both options A and B, option D, none of the above. The correct answer is, option C. Abu Ali Sina, wrote several books, on methods of collecting, and storing medicinal plants, and medicine making process, such as pills, suppositories, syrups, and combining medical knowledge from several countries, to produce better treatment. Question 16. Which of the following successfully verified 
the effects of pharmacology and toxicology in experiments on animals. Option A Abu Ali Sina. Option B Johann Jacob Wepfer. Option C Claudius Galen. Option D Paracelsus. The correct answer is Option B. Johann Jacob Wepfer successfully verified the effects of pharmacology and toxicology in experiments on animals. Question 17. Which of the following have been origin of preclinical testing? Option A, human experiments. Option B, animal experiments. Option C, planned experiments. Option D, microscope experiments. The correct answer is option B. Animal experiments have been origin of preclinical testing, which until now is a requirement before the drug is tested clinically in humans. Question 18. The traditional healers in traditional medicine were initially developed in which of the following countries? Option A, China, Greece, Korea, Germany, and some European regions. Option B, England, India, Wales, America, and some African regions. Option C, Greece, Middle East, Small Asia, China, and other Asian regions. Option D, France, Germany, Middle East, China, and other Asian regions. The correct answer is, Option C. The traditional healers, in traditional medicine, was initially developed in, Greece, Middle East, Small Asia, China, and other Asian regions and spread to many countries that adopted this medical science. Question 19. In which of the following city of USA, the first pharmacy college was developed in 1821? Option A, New York. Option B, Chicago. Option C, Dallas. Option D, Philadelphia. The correct answer is, Option D. The first pharmacy college was developed in Philadelphia, USA, in 1821, and after that, many pharmacy college and faculty began to be established around the world, along with the increasing spread of pharmaceutical science. Thank you.